Hi, this is Olli from the Custom Tools team here at ADRsoft. Um, I'm going to show a sneak preview of our SolidWorks or SolidWorks PDM um, to Microsoft Business Central ERP integration. Um, with the Custom Tools solution, we can uh, take your CAD or PDM structure as is and we can trigger an export and integration to various systems um, in this is an example uh, microsoft business central erp so when we take the full structure or any given sub assembly um, we can trigger the export manually uh, from inside solidworks or alternatively from a pdm workflow or through the right-click context menu in PDM. Um, in both cases, we get a export preview window um, from which we, we can see which uh, um, CAD properties we have mapped, uh, what is the structure that will be um, exported to the ERP system, um, what is the number sequence that will be used, and so on. We can see which lines will be ignored based on, on certain um, configured rules. We can see which lines, uh, which bomb lines already exist in the ERP system. We can see which lines uh, would be created if we trigger the export. Um, the end result in the in this example in the cloud version of of uh, Business Central will look like this. We will firstly um, create all of the items in ERB based on the actual uh, CAD items that we exported. So in this case, this was my top level assembly. I can see we get the preview um, image stored as the picture for the item in ERB. Uh, we can map um, any given CAD properties to basically any given um, ERP item card fields. We can also um, see uh, how things are linked here. So we can do where used uh, queries. We can um, browse production bombs. So as this was the top level item, we have also created a production bomb uh, with the same one-click export uh, for this assembly or product. So here we can see all the created bombs. And if we open, for example, the top-level bomb, we can see all the individual items and uh, sub-assemblies. Now, if I take uh, a given individual um, item that we created from CAD 1033, if I go here and open it, we can see again properties, we can see the preview image, and we can also traverse this structure the other direction. So if we go here, bill of materials, production, we can also do a very used query where from the item we can see in which bills of materials it has been used. And open, you know, the bomb from here. So this gives us a way to easily um, export CAD structures uh, to, for example, manufacturing, purchasing, um, sourcing, use in uh, the supported ERP systems. If you're interested to find out more, um, contact us at sales at today.